This morning, police overseas made an arrest in the case of a rogue trader responsible for a $2 billion loss at the Swiss bank UBS. CBS News correspondent Charlie Daggett joins us with details from London this morning. Charlie, good morning. Good morning to you, Jeff. Yes, officials at UBS confirm they've taken a $2 billion hit in unauthorized trades by a rogue trader. Uh, Britain's Financial Times identifies the 31-year-old trader as Kweku Aduboli. It's one of the biggest losses ever in rogue trading. British police arrested the suspect this morning. UBS warns it may post an overall loss in the third quarter because of the bad deals. It threatens the future of the bank, which had already been struggling to cope with the credit crisis and a scandal over helping rich U.S. clients dodge taxes. Swiss company is also one of a handful of foreign banks to receive U.S. bailout money, more than $5 billion. The bank says no individual clients were affected in the rogue trades. Jeff? All right, Charlie, thanks very much.